everybody, this is Jason Goodson with Gardening with Goody, and this is my 30-day vlog challenge. I'm going to be showing you something about my life every day for the next 30 days. I am out of school a little early today, and I'm going to show you a little walk through the garden. So here we are in the garden, and I've started these sugar snap peas right here, some of my favorite of all time. All right, so check out these nasturtiums right here. These are going to be so nice when we get these planted. I'm looking forward to putting them in the ground and giving them a place to call home. This is the only bucket I've planted so far, and it's full of broccoli. Hopefully, we'll see it grow straight up through. We'll feed it right here, give it its fertilizer and water as needed. These tomato plants didn't look like they were this big a few weeks ago, but now... They are starting to flourish through here and they're starting to grow up into the cages here and we're starting to find that we have a few blooms in here as well. We should start seeing our production of tomatoes pretty soon. So check here right behind me. I got this huge pile of wood chips off the side of the road on Highway 49 here in Mineola, Texas and it was delivered to my property, dumped here and now I get to use it all throughout my garden and I didn't pay a dime for it. Such a great resource for us to use. This truly is a plant, arugula, that grows really fast. If you notice these st stalks right here are already producing some seeds and they grow really fast. It's a rocket plant. The spinach is looking good as well. Really love how the spinach is turning out in our garden and they do a great job of producing some really good food for us. Back behind me here you'll notice our new trellis is up in our box that has corn, some green beans that are growing. We are really excited about that. You'll notice right behind me here we have our potatoes that are really starting to grow in really well. I'm excited about that. I gotta cover them up though. So part of growing a bigger onion is always getting the best rotation out of your onion. So what I'm gonna do is reach down right here, grab the onion stalk itself, and twirl it. Let's do the swirl. The swirl. This is a very good technique of growing a larger onion. Pretty cool. All right, so behind me here, you'll notice my pile of wood chips we talked about the other day. I'm going way down. Now I'm going to show you where they're at. Okay, so the wood chips that we featured the other day, I have stacked in the garden behind me here. They're about 8 to 12 inches deep, depending on what spot they're in. It goes all the way down to the very back and surrounds all of the raised beds. Hey, this has been day one 
of the 30-day vlog challenge with Gardening with Goody. And we started in the garden. And we'll see you next time. Do me a favor.